Hello, Bumpy McSquiggums here, and it's time for us to continue with our very important LP of Project Zomboy. This is episode 7, and Mutana has joined me, sort of. Um, I had a power outage, and my router reset, and all that wonderful fun stuff. And, and my character died. Yeah, and apparently Mutana's character got deleted, so he's starting fresh. I am still here. We did do a run up to the lumber mill off-camera, because we figured it'd be kind of boring. Most of the zombies we had already killed, there wasn't... We didn't actually come across anything at all, if I recall correctly. No. So it was basically us just looting boxes. Um, I'm not sure if Mutanot managed to offload the stuff that he looted. I did. Oh, gosh. But we found quite a bit of stuff, and it was pretty nice. Do you um, notice all that fence I built? I see it. I don't remember if you did that when I was on before or not. But they should notice. And you'll notice our potatoes and our tomatoes look like they're in bloom, so I'm going to actually go and focus a lot more on our garden. I do love some blooming potatoes. Well, as long as they're Call not me bloomin Orlando onions. Bloomin' Onion. Ugh. Bloomin' Onions, or any kind of onions, are just meh. Alright, let's see. Are the tomatoes actually ready? That was actually a robot nope. chicken joke. There are still young... There are still young tomatoes. Alright, so I'm going to go get some potato seeds and my trowel, and we're going to go to work. We found a watering can, which was something we were searching for. There's still a lot of stuff left for us to find. Oh, gosh. A little zombie outside my door. Goodbye, zombie. So Mutana's trying to find his way back to our place here. I'm getting it, pretty good at this point. Yeah, it's... I mean, the city's only so large. Oof. Um I do like stabbing people with knives. I got a better knife right now. It looks cool, but it's it's kind of dangerous, so be careful. Who cares? <laughs> uh, yeah. It doesn't matter. I don't, I, I'm immortal at this point. <laughs> I've already died once. Yeah, and I've uh, been reset once. The man can't hold me down. That's true. So technically he can die as often as he wants at this point because it doesn't really make any difference. Because it's all on me now. And no, I didn't die, even though we are in a different area than we logged off in. We figured that, like I said, we would actually go through if you see all my skills are the same as it was. Or maybe a little bit better than they were. But we figured, again, we wouldn't bore you guys with the runs up to the... What was it? Was it a sawmill? Is that what huh. we're calling it? I don't actually know where I am. That's not good. There's some... Well, I'm on the main road, finally. I'm in a different storage unit. Interesting. There's some intense music going on right now. Well, that's good. You're an intense person. Also, guys, I didn't know if Mutana and I would actually be able to do Project Zomboid today, so I did a bonus cast of Mutana and Micah's game, and I have to say... I was pretty embarrassed to know them. Mutana didn't play poorly, but he got way under farmed and he made so many bad choices based on trying to help his idiot teammates. The disruptor was really bad, and Micah he was played a, a Daniel disruptor. I have glimpse. Terrible. Micah played absolutely awful. Glimpse is a worthless ability. Yeah, glimpse is like the most ridiculous skill ever in the history of the of the world. And he, oh, it's a terrible, it's a terrible ability. No, it's not. No, it's not. Glimpse is good. All right, so let's open this up. And I have potato seeds somewhere. There they are. Oh man, <coughs> oh. I might be in trouble. Well, are you dying or? Well, I don't know where on the road I am. I think it started me east of the bank, and I've been running east. Now it's raining. Yeah. And zombies are trying to kill me. Sounds like a typical day in, in the life of Mutana. I mean, like a lot of zombies. You like zombies? A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of zombies. How can I be thirsty when it's raining? I don't. Well, I mean, you can always be thirsty when it's raining. You just don't look up with your mouth open like a weird person. Could be acid rain. Could be zombie rain. You don't know. All right, I need to turn around, but this is gonna be dangerous. Hey, you know what? You're going to build up that sprinting that we just can't seem to do. And in the meantime, I'm going to... I thought I was going to actually plant a bunch of cabbages, but I ran out of cabbage planting thing. It grows better, whether we like cabbage or not. So... You get hyperthermia. That's fine. Actually, is that fine? I don't know, but man, these new sound effects are creepy. I know. There was quite a few new sound effects, guys. Uh, there was a new eating effect, which is weird. Like, you, you actually hear yourself going, nom, 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 which is kind of fun. The power is now officially out. I don't think the water is shut off yet, so we're still okay on that front. And I am starting to plot some stuff for some strawberries here. 
I hope I didn't jump to the wrong town somehow. No, he didn't. You probably need to head more west, like northwest, like top left of the street. Well, I'm on the main road, and I headed east, but I think it jumped me. Oh. I'm pretty sure, uh, like I went, I'm like all the way to east, like at the end of town. Well, you should run into. Or, I don't think we're that far away from the end of town, actually. There's a really cool building up here. Wait, what am I selling? Oh, I'm selling tomato seeds. No, 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 no. Sorry, guys. I'm I'm somewhat retarded right now. We're going to dig that up. Sorry, I'm going to dig that, and I forgot to. What did you say was over there? Uh, really cool building. It's the one that's in some of the screenshots that people did. Well, that narrows Where it down. With like the roof and the chair. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I vaguely remember seeing that before. All right, well, I'm getting hungry, and we're down to unfortunateness. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Oh, I just heard gunfire. Did you? Yep. Well, that means you got to be somewhat close. Why did you stab him with your kitchen knife? You're talking about. Have you found any bodies yet? Because there's still bodies laying all over the place over here. Yeah, I'm over by the one restaurant. Oh, so you were east, okay. Yeah, I just didn't realize until now. I'm at the POC pancake house of something. Oh my goodness, yeah. I don't I don't know how I'm gonna run through this. With a lot of a lot of magic and awesome. I don't suppose you wanna come come kill a whole bunch of zombies for TV. Hey, I am a gardener right now. And I need to eat, so let's see here. Um, oh gosh! <clears throat> all right, hold on. I'm gonna eat a potato. A lunger. If that heals me. I'll be okay. Uh, I'm at the Zippo market. Okay, I'm equipping my bat in both hands. <laughs> Bring two said. bats. I can't. I can, but this one's gonna break if I pick it up. So I shall bring it. Maybe there we go. I'm at the burger joint. All right, I'm running. I will hopefully drop one that I don't have equipped. Here we go. There you go. It's weak, but you might get a couple hits out of it. You did bring a, a large train of zombies. Right? I've heard of the soul train. I've never heard of the zombie train. When I, when I bring zombies, I come to party. Like it's 1642. I say, I don't know how long the bat's gonna last. Oh, gosh. Uh. Great, it already wore off. <laughs> Go get more bats. I got this. Maybe. There's a lot of zombies. Or get your shotgun. Ooh. Uh, we never found a shotgun. We found pistols. We have a lot of shotgun ammo, though. Alright. Let's get a little closer here. A little up close and personal with the zombies. So, zombies, how do you feel chasing Mutana all that way? Well, brains! Eh. Somehow I thought you might say something like that. Is that it? Huh? That's it? Oh, oh, nope. Oh god, that was a lunger. Tried to bite my toe. That was a toe biter. That's how I, that's how I died in my uh, weekly run of this. I hate these things. There we go. There's more. I just got the pistol! Oh, Don't leave yet. Can't help it. I'm too efficient at what I do. My bat's pretty weak. Hmm. Re you have to put bullets in your, in your thing and then hit R to reload it. Oh gosh. Oh. That is loud. Now let's see how your aim is. Oh, you got one. You got two. Three. Reload. Oh, oh my gosh, that was a terrible idea. Right? What have you done? Tana's it's okay, I think I'm winning. Tana's always bringing the hate down on us. That's what he does. Oh, out of bullets. Alright, you're oh, on your own. Oh. Okay. Hey guys, over here. 
Fresh pancake. Fresh human pancakes, huh? Eh? Eh? I'll get the golf club. There should be a bat in there somewhere still, I think. Might be. Hey, look, it's Bippo's drive through guys. Huh? Get your humans with a side order of brains. Come on. You can do it. No, not you. You don't get to touch me. Alright, well, in theory, I lost at least a vast majority of the zombies. I have to repair the pistol? Really? That's a thing? I don't know. I'll address that after I kill the zombie outside the front door. Alright, well, apparently we're winded. We are highly exerted. We are not having a good day. Oh, but we got sprinting leveled up. Oh, snippity snap. You're welcome. Finally. Alright, let's see if we can move over here. Wow, I'm having a horrible time teeing off of the zombie's head. Yeah, most people do soon have that issue. You have another one coming. You have another three coming. Alright, you get to play in there. I'm gonna go repair my bat. Good luck. We're all counting on you. Did I leave the front door open? I think I did. Well, I'm gonna go close that, because I don't want zombies in the bank. Or eating our vegetables. Yeah. Well, I got some potatoes out of the deal, so... We are starting to become self-sufficient. We don't have water barrels yet. That's something we're gonna have to look up and do. Um, Build it with carpentry. Which, you no longer are our carpenter, so that is a problem. What was I going to do? Oh, I was going to repair my bat. That's what it was. Grab one. We have some nails. Grab some nails. We got all sorts of stuff, guys. We have some duct tape. I mean, all sorts of crazy things. All right. Gotta tell you, not impressed with the golf club. How come? Well, how, what kind of damage does it do in comparison? We have a crowbar in here as well. Uh, damage is really terrible. Oh. You'd think that that would actually be pretty pretty good weapon, you know. Even better than maybe a bat. You can, like, split the skull and stuff. Must have nerfed it. It's a, it's a nerf golf club. Is that the music bass sound, or is that an actual zombie banging on the wall? I, I don't hear a zombie music. banging on the wall anymore, so... Yeah. Alright. Well, there's still some zombies out front here. Got to take care of them, and then we can go back to our gardening. You know what else I don't have is a Mo freaking backpack. A Mo backpack? Well, that's easy Mo enough. Mo backpack. And I finally understand what people were saying about zombies as bags. I, I'm a little slow, guys. I'm a little slow. Basically, mean put stuff in the bodies, but we don't need that. We have enough storage space inside the bank. And just leave the bodies around inside the bank and use them as bag. Yeah, see, I, I got you. I got you. A little slow on the uptake sometimes, but. I'm like, what, you can actually craft a bag out of, like, zombie flesh? Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean? You don't want to do that, it's scary. I feel like That's a zombie creepy. Where like do you put the potatoes? I have them in my inventory. Papa needs to eat. You can come outside, I'll drop some. Grab a water bottle. Yeah. There should be one in the downstairs, actually, with water in it, so. There's one by the cooler. Man, I had so many bags of chips. I'm very upset about that. Well, you were the chip hoarder, huh? Alright, there's oh. there's some potatoes laying on the ground. It looks like I just you know dropped how long it takes to hoard that many chip bags? Nope, can't say that I do. Alright, what was I doing over here? I think I was getting some more cabbage seeds. Where are they at? It looks like a deuce I dropped in the middle of the parking lot. I see that. Yeah. It's fine. Okay, what are we going to continue to sow the seeds of misfortune? We're still very, very panicked. I guess seeing a ginormous horde of zombies probably doesn't put you at ease. Oh, the saying. new gun sound was quite loud. Yeah, yeah, they they did that a couple, couple patches ago. Cause I remember that. Remember when we first came here? I'm like, I'm gonna lead them away with my gun. Yeah, it was really loud then too. Oh, and it looks like we're going back into the night cycle. Yay. Alright, we're going to get some more strawberry plants. And we are going to plant them. And I don't know what this thing in the middle is. Where? 
Uh, I don't know what I planted here. Maybe it's a tomato? What is it? It is a tomato. I'm going to get rid of that. This is the strawberry zone, man. The strawberry zone. We only want strawberries here. Yeah, so, yeah, unfortunately, after the stream today, guys, I did not feel super fantastic, so I kind of went down for the count. Passed out for a while. Skipped dinner and everything, so, meh. Hey, I found a spare bag I set. Yay. Alright, darn it, I need one more uh, strawberry plant. I'm less Let's worthless see. if I could just get a, a better weapon. Well, there's a flashlight, too, so you can do that. I thought we had baseball bats in here. We didn't? There's a whole bunch on the floor out there. Yeah, but those are all broken. I might be able to repair them. Yeah, no. I did add some more stuff back to the thing. We have spades, we have trowels, we have twine, we have wire, planks, roasting pans. Is the water oranges? Where's the watering thing? There it is, watering can. I'm gonna steal that. I'm gonna put the nails and the hammer you back. Into your fertilizer. Um, that just basically speeds up the process. There's a flashlight there, and there should be a battery around as well, so you should be fine. Alright, so I'll throw that in there. Put the seeds away. And, let's see, strawberry, strawberry. And we're going to open the strawberry seed packet, and we're going to leave this place in the pitch blackness that is... Project Zomboid. I think our tomatoes are getting pretty close to being ripe. So they each have different growing days. I'm not sure how long it's going to take. Oh, oh, that was a painful sneeze. I'm sorry. Oh, you, you made it in time. I heard the mute blob sound, but oh, you seem to have made it. Could have been so much worse. Yeah. Alright, so let's see. Are any of these things watered? Well watered and flourishing. Excellent. I think I'm going to get rid of the bodies and move them out of our area here. Huh. To repair a pistol, potentially repair 60%. Chance of success, 5%. That doesn't sound good. What do you need to repair it? Is that mechanical or something? I, I don't know, I guess. No, I wouldn't try repairing it. Well, we have like two or three pistols. I mean, technically. I, I don't have the, the, the weather all as it were, to repair it anyway, so it doesn't matter. Huh. Well, our, isn't our garden lovely, folks? We have the first harvest that we've eaten. I'm no longer exhausted. I have some sprinting done. Uh, I'm getting there. I'm getting my levels up. That's, that's good. That's good. Uh, I wouldn't know about any of that. We have mutant here. Bare-chested and angry. What are you using? Is that a rolling pin? No, it's a crowbar. Well, it looks like a sausage or a bat. He said sausage or bat. I did. I did say those things. Both. Both of those things, in fact. There's still a lot of zombies out here. Yeah, you can go kill them. I still have watering to do with my poor little innocent plants. You're over here playing with your... Well, I'm a gardener, guys. It's what I do. Hey, we're going to have to eat at some point. And since you lost our giant chip supply, which I totally would live off of, by the way, in real life, um, I would. I love chips. Like, to me, that can be a meal. Because I usually only eat one meal a day. Well, lately I've been doing two. It used to be, like, one meal a day. I would, I would subsidize that with, like, chips. Like Doritos or something. Real healthy for you, I gotta tell you. That's why you have the body of an Olympian. I do. I do. It's true. Well, I am successfully mostly repairing this one baseball bat. Successfully mostly repairing? What does that mean? What does that mean? It's half repaired. Which half? Just the tip. Oh, jeez. Alright, well, I can't seem to you use that You walked into that one. You, half of it is a tip? Oh, dear God. We're going to have to have a talk, aren't we? Fill the oh, watering no, can. Oh, it unrepaired itself. Dag nabbit. Yeah, that's the downside with the repair. You can always make it worse and not better. Why right. is the wall glowing? You must be out there. 
You found my call sign. Surprise! Back to watering the stuff. So we're gonna go do some more zombie killing here in a minute, guys. Just wanna make sure all my lovely strawberries and other various things are well watered. Well, well watered? Doesn't He's really this creepy in real life. Doesn't sound good. The water levels are fine. Somebody could be helping me right now with this, but no. I'm busy repairing your bats that you said were unrepairable. No. <laughs> busy repairing the bats that you said were unrepairable, that I said I didn't want to take the time to repair. There's a clear and present difference. Just like if we were Harrison Ford, there'd be a clear and present danger. You need to build a campfire in here so I can see. I, I think you should do that outside. Probably not inside is good. I don't know. Can you catch fire in this game? Probably, knowing me. I would do it, even if you can't. Alright, whatever, we have enough plants that are watered-ish. Ish. And our potatoes are... in bloom. Alright, so we actually have the next uh, set of potatoes that we can gather. I think I'm going to gather one of them. I'm going to harvest one. You can come harvest another set of potatoes if you want. The flowery bushes that look like cotton, sort of. Those are apparently potato. Oh, I need a trowel? Um, I don't know. You can try it. I'm gonna go build another fence section here. Off to the left are there, the little flowery ones. Alright, I'm gonna go murder some zombies. Uh, let's murder to the right. I wanna... Yeah. There's a storage unit over there somewhere. There's a storage unit over there with zombie flesh and I wanna eat on my bacon. What? That made no sense. Oh gosh. Ow. Eh. You guys do like... Running headbutts on people. That's not cool, man. I've been working on the fence. Oh, my live long days. See, I'm, I'm the gardener. He's apparently the fencer. I don't know. That sounds cooler than the gardener. I think I've been robbed. Probably because it is. Go down, Zapato. Oh, gosh, it's you. Go down, Zapato. Why are you immune to death? Die, horrible evil creature! Death holds no hold over me. What he said, only clearer and less not right. Gobbly goop. They get really angry at gunshots, I'll tell you what. Yeah, they do. I wouldn't go to the south side of Zippo's. It will not end well for us. That's where I led the entire train of zombies that were chasing us. Alright, double brain smashing. What? That's what we do, folks. That's what we do. We're going to break off the episode relatively soon. We have about two or three minutes left of zombie murder, and then we can actually break it off. You got to see some pistol action. The storage ah! unit. Well, you'll be able to. Unfortunately, I have other things that are going to require my attention. The world does not stop for un unwell feeling bumpy. I still won't have as much as Doesn't I wanted. It? I had a bad weekend too. I it's, I didn't feel bad. I just couldn't get anything done. That's the worst when you you feel okay and you just can't be productive because things happen. Oh, I hate it. Oh gosh. Uh, have we looted this store? There's no telling what we've done. Probably. All right. I'm having a zombie apocalypse happen. Oh wait. That's still kind of the whole premise of the game. <laughs> I have a much larger horde of the zombies coming to apocalyze me. Is that a thing? Apocalyze? Ooh. Straight up got her in the back of the head. There we go. Alright. I just murdered like 15, 30 zombies. Oh, snippity snap. Come here. Hold on. Die, old lady. Come to me quickly, or I will kill... Ooh, another pistol. What? What's this on the ground next to my foot? I'll kill the zombie coming after you. Ooh. Uh-oh. Somehow, even though I pushed her away, I got hurt. Oh, I was scratched on my lower torso. No! Quick, bandage it. I actually don't have any bandages on me. Do you have any bandages on you? Nope. All right. Tear up your sweater yeah. vest. Sweater vest. I'm not Gus. Craft a sheep rope. I don't know. Uh, it's funny. All right. Well, I'm gonna, I'm going to, bandage my lower torso here. 
I want to point out it's not my groin. <clears throat> you don't know that for sure. I'm pretty sure I know that. How sure? Pretty darn to extremely sure. I think it's time to take some vitamins. And... Oh gosh, there's a zombie on me. Didn't hit me this time. Yeah, I don't That's know. Good. That last one didn't seem like it hit me. There were other ones that did seem like it hit me, so I guess it all balances out in the end, but still. Alright, I'm going to go back and get well fed. Oh, I have potatoes on me. I can get well fed from here. I need to try my axe out. Go ahead. There's a lot of zombies down below. See if that breaks. I think last time it didn't break. Alright, I just ate two potatoes. I'm well fed. My, my hurt thing is actually uh, gone, so I'm healing. Which is good. It's good that I'm healing. Alright, I can get another one in maintenance or farming. Yeah. Oh, they're angry. Let me go with farming. Let's ch check the uh, condition of my bat. It's about half. Oh, yeah. Alright, well, you can go kill him. I'm gonna kill this guy down here. I know the sledgehammer destroys walls. Can the axe destroy walls? I think it can chop down doors. Ah! Stop trying to kill me. Check out the, uh, the durability or condition of the axe. Also, I think these are glass doors. Oh, they're actually not. Are those doors at all, or are those walls? And how come they can walk right through it? Are those windows? I, I don't know. Where are you? Where did you go? Over here. There's a real door in the back of this restaurant. Let's go there. I'd be very careful where you're at. Shame. They're mostly dead. I'm, there, there's way more than you. Oh yeah, look, there's planks on the ground. If you just did that, and a doorknob. <laughs> we can harvest ourselves doors. That was so me. Oh, well, I guess it does pay to. Whoa, 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 whoa! Where, what? Where did they come from? I don't know, but there's a giant wooden fence here with my name on it. There's also a whole horde of zombies over here with a lot of blood on it. This guy, a little bald head. Eh. Eh. Okay. Well, I'm definitely going to look through some more zombie. Oh, another pistol. So we never need to repair the pistol. We'll just keep finding more. Oh, baseball bat. Really? Yep. So it seems like they did finally oh. up the... Uh, oh, you okay? Yeah, she just lunged over the fence on me. Well, I think it was around the fence, but I got you, I got you. Alright, folks, I think we're going to break out the episode while Mutana tries to figure out how to chop down the fence. It doesn't seem to be working. No, apparently you can only chop down doors. I think the sledgehammer is probably for fences and walls and things of that nature. Daddy wants another door. Alright, well, Bumpy's going to head back to the base. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. I did get wounded, but I seem to be fine. I bandaged my well-fed status. Seemed to mean that I was okay. Our plants are finally in bloom. We have a watering can. Things are starting to look up for us. Even if Mutanot did have to restart his character again. It's kind of his thing, I guess. Anytime something happens... Ah! He's got to restart. Now he sounds like he's having some sort of issue or problem. I mean, we should actually see the tomatoes pop up in the next one, so... Just a case of too much zombie love. Well, I'll leave you with your red-hot zombie love. I'm going to go back into base camp, Pantalones de Fuego. No, that was my base camp and don't starve. But, I don't know. We should name our base camp. What say you? Next episode... Well, we get some paint, we can. Ne next episode, we'll, uh... We'll na I don't want to dig the water trough there. Stop it. All your planks are belong to me. Uh oh. We no door is safe. Might not have water anymore. I don't have to go to the lumber camp ever again. No, there just won't be any doors in the bank left. Oh no, we can do it again. Yay! I can fill watering stuff again. All right, so I think our next mission, guys, in the next episode is we're gonna try to figure out how to build a water barrel so we can catch rainwater and use that because I think we're starting to get pretty low on the things that we can do. Granted, we still have a lot of stuff left over. I think our mustard went bad. Oh. No, no, it didn't. It's fine. It just looks 
nasty. Rotten mustard, I hate it. Rotten mustard for the win. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. We'll see you next time with more Project Zomboid. Until then, he's Mutanot, I'm Bumpy, and we will see you later. <laughs>